it's date night guys good evening from upstate new york we are in glenmont which is roughly outside of albany for a little bit of reference uh as you know we love movies and a few weeks ago on prince edward island we took our motorhome camper 4x4 expedition vehicle whatever the heck you want to call it to the drive-in movie theater and we figured let's do that again we checked in ahead of time with them through Facebook Messenger and they said that we were welcome to come with our tall rig but we should come through the back entrance so that we wouldn't uh, catch their overhang <laughs> at the box office so we thought that was kind of cute well here's a tip for uh, visiting the drive-in with your motorhome it's probably best if you don't take the front row okay they said it was not gonna be a packed house so we could pretty much park wherever we wanted and that there was no need to park in the back 40. Well, Shelby is eating her dinner and tonight's features are Venom and Searching and they both look like really good movies. We have a little bonus for you. Lisa, the owner of the Jericho Theater here is gonna give us a behind the scenes peek. Hi. I'm excited. <laughs> Oh, now here's where the magic happens. Excuse the mess. Cleaning out for the fall. Okay. This is our projector. That's cool. All digital. Yeah. Correct. This is the old style. Kind of buried. Okay. This is what we used to have. Now is that on a reel? Yep. Right here. Oh, wow. So that's the original. It's called a um, sword system. That is too cool. And they would come in on reels that are little like this in canisters. See the reels? Oh wow. So they would come in in a big huge can or a canister about you know that big with three or four in one and two or three in the other and then my husband would slice them together and it would start on this side and the movie would go up and over and down and through the uh, lamp house and onto this reel. So That's it would go so this side to this cool. Side. And we had two of them, so the old one is in there. Now, do you guys, is this all like on a DVD this nowadays? Is all or is this it a is file that they give you? This is what they come in on. Oh. It's like a VHS tape. Oh, wow. And you just plug it in your server, download it, build the show. That's pretty and awesome. And come in and hit play. It's fun. It is. It's you know, so much fun. We've it's had a little it. escape from reality. Yeah, it is. It's definitely fun. It's nostalgic and it's out of the ordinary. And in the summer, we're packed. Yeah. Now, we're not so much. It's a little cold. But it's also a great part of Americana. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, we went to a drive in theater in Prince Edward Island a couple weeks ago. Oh, okay. So it's Canadian Econa as well. Well, Lisa, thank you thank so you. very thank much. You appreciate it and we are looking forward to the features tonight okay oh it's 49 degrees out here honey so we thought we might sit outside but it's a little too chilly uh to be comfortable and uh, fortunately, this is a real added bonus, a nice surprise. Uh, Lisa and Mike said we can stay the night here. Who has ever stayed the night in a movie theater? I know it's a drive-in, not like the indoor, but either way, they're both cool. 36, biological interactions between two different organisms. Now tell me this is not one of the coolest things to do with your RV ever. Here's an added bonus I didn't think of. We can go to the bathroom and watch the movie and not miss a thing. There will be a brief intermission. You'll be warned in plenty of time before the start of our second feature. Thank you. Well, good morning, guys. I'd say uh, one of the downfalls of bringing your motorhome or camper to a drive-in is it's mighty easy to fall asleep. So I hope you enjoyed this little peek inside the projector room. 
Thank you so much to uh, the Jericho Drive-In for letting us park for the night here and uh, showing us around. We had a lot of fun. And I would encourage you, if you liked this, give it a shot. Take your uh, camper, motorhome, I don't know about a travel trailer, that's a little iffy, but give them a call first, make sure there's space, make sure they're okay with it, and it's a lot of fun, great thing to do with the family. So thanks for watching, hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you later.